Hey everyone, it's Raphael from XX Raphael Productions, and I'm gonna show you how to add a flickering effect in Movavi for your video. So I'm gonna show you my first example right now. You can kind of see the video is flickering pretty hard here. And then here's my second example where I uploaded a video on May 25th about kind of like a, a camera glitching out type of effect. It was a free stock footage. So I'm gonna show you how to add that kind of effect in your video, all right? So dragging in my example clip right here, I'm gonna drag it right onto the Movavi timeline. And I'm gonna go ahead and play this clip first so you can see how it looks like. It's normal with no effects for now. Simply just me filming myself walking around um, this area. So as you can see, it's very simple. There is no um, effect yet. So to add the filter, I'm gonna head over to the um, second um, button over here. It says filters. And then look for the one that says broken lens. If you cannot find it, just simply search it up right here. So broken lens and drag it into the, um, the video itself. And if it's successfully added, you should see the star right over here. So click play again. And now if you notice, the video looks like it's occasionally glitching out. So, in my opinion, I think that's a bit um, like that's a bit tame. So to actually edit the effect, click on the star. So directly click on it, and then you should get this. You can adjust it whether you want more or you want less. So let's so the effect intensity right now is thirty percent by default. Let's maybe do that to about maybe seventy six percent. Let's see how that goes. So you can see that the effect is a lot more intense the more I drag it to the right. Now obviously, if I were to do it to the left, let me pause this video right now. Okay, wait a minute. Okay, so obviously if I were to do that to the left, like let's do 0%, obviously that means the effects will not show at all. But you can control the intensity of each effect with the slider. Um, yeah, that's simply how you do it. So thank you very much for watching and I hope this video helped you out. And I'll see you in the next one.